Coronal mass ejections, CMEs, are occasional occurrences in which the Sun's dynamic magnetic field emits substantial amounts of plasma into the universe. In addition to causing awe-inspiring auroras on Earth, these solar events can also result in substantial disruptions to our electrical networks and satellite communications. NASA's Parker Solar Probe has achieved a significant breakthrough by offering an unparalleled view of a coronal mass ejection, CME, as it originated from the Sun. Scientists studying the Sun have uncovered intriguing information from this peak located at the core of a coronal mass ejection, CME. NASA's Parker Solar Probe, an innovative spacecraft, was launched in 2018 with the objective of making a historic first contact with the Sun. The probe has granted us a brief insight into the eruption of a coronal mass ejection, CME, from the Sun. The Wide Field Imager for Parker Solar Probe, YSPR instrument, successfully acquired high-resolution images of turbulent eddies within the coronal mass ejection, CME phenomenon, referred to as Kelvin-Helmholtz, instabilities through the use of the probe. It happens when two fluids or gases with varying velocities collide, resulting in the formation of a wave-like pattern. On Earth, this phenomenon is observable in clouds or in the ocean when distinct strata of water exhibit varying velocities. Within the framework of coronal mass ejections, CMEs, these instabilities occur due to the interaction between the plasma inside the CME and the surrounding solar wind, resulting in the formation of a turbulent environment. The magnitude of this finding cannot be exaggerated. Kelvin-Helmholtz instabilities generate turbulence that significantly influences the behavior of coronal mass ejections, CMEs, as they traverse the solar wind. Comprehending this turbulence is crucial for deciphering the enigmas surrounding the evolution and kinematics of CMEs. According to a solar physicist and evangelist powerist affiliated with George Mason University, a comprehensive comprehension of turbulence is crucial for attaining a more profound understanding of the evolution and kinematics of coronal mass ejections, CMEs. This significant advancement marks the initial stage. The elliptical trajectory of the Parker solar probes has taken it in closer proximity to the sun's corona than any previously constructed probe hence offering unparalleled prospects for investigating the Sun's outer atmosphere. As the mission progresses, it is anticipated that the probe will approach with greater proximity, thereby offering the potential for further significant findings regarding the Sun's dynamics and its impact on our solar system. The probe conducted a recent research where it gathered data on 28 coronal mass ejections, CMEs, over a span of four years yielding a substantial amount of knowledge regarding these immense solar events. One of the key discoveries derived from this study pertains to the escalating intricacy of the internal magnetic configuration of coronal mass ejections, CMEs, as the radial distance increases. As the coronal mass ejections, CMEs, progress away from the Sun, their magnetic fields undergo a process of increased complexity, which subsequently impacts their development and interaction with the adjacent solar wind. The intricate nature of this phenomenon has significant ramifications for comprehending the propagation of CMEs in space and their effects on planetary ecosystems. Another significant finding pertains to the rate of decline in the magnetic field intensity of coronal mass ejections, CMEs. In contrast to prior research, the Parker Solar Probe detected a decelerated rate of decline, indicating that coronal mass ejections, CMEs, retain a greater amount of their magnetic energy as they venture further away from the Sun. This observation poses a challenge to current models of coronal mass ejection, CME, behavior, and requires a reassessment of our comprehension of these solar phenomena. The evolution of CMEs is significantly influenced by their expansion. The research revealed that this expansion plays a crucial role in the formation of the compression region in front of them, hence exerting an influence on space weather conditions in close proximity to Earth. Furthermore, the interactions between the internal magnetic field of coronal mass ejections, CMEs, and the solar wind are influenced by the short-scale variations occurring within the compression area. The ramifications of these findings are significant in the context of space weather forecasting 
and the safeguarding of technical infrastructure from solar storms. Scientists can enhance their ability to forecast the effects of CMEs on Earth and minimize potential disruptions to power grids, communication networks, and satellite operations by comprehending the progression of CMEs. The mission of the Parker probe encompasses more than the investigation of coronal mass ejections. The extraordinary expedition to the Sun has resulted in a sequence of revelations that are transforming our comprehension of the solar system. One notable observation made by the probe is the identification of a region devoid of dust in close proximity to the Sun. For than a century, astronomers have postulated the presence of a solar region in which dust particles undergo sublimation, resulting in the formation of a dust-free area. The notion is confirmed by the Parker Solar Probe's Wide Field Imager, which observes the light reflected from dust dimming at around 19 solar radios to the Sun. The findings of this study carry substantial consequences for our comprehension of the genesis and evolution of solar systems, as well as the dynamics of the inner solar system. An additional significant accomplishment pertains to the detection of magnetic switchbacks within the solar wind. The probe's fields instrument detected these swift reversals in the sun's magnetic field. It is postulated that the switchbacks can be traced back to magnetic funnels located on the solar surface, which emerge amidst convection cell structures known as supergranules. This finding holds significant importance in comprehending the mechanisms underlying the solar wind and its impact on the Earth's space environment. The Parker Solar Probe's integrated science investigation of the Sun instrument has significantly contributed to the understanding of solar energetic particles. The prevalence and diversity of these high-energy particles, which were previously believed to be infrequent and originating directly from the Sun, have been observed to exceed initial expectations. The investigations conducted by ISIYS revealed that SEPs can be perturbed by switchbacks and can traverse courses that are twice as lengthy as originally anticipated. These findings have important consequences for our comprehension of the acceleration of SEPs and their influence on the solar system. In addition to studying the Sun, the Parker Solar Probe has made other significant contributions. It has conducted research on comets, identified radio emissions from Venus's atmosphere, and obtained the initial photographs of Venus's surface using wavelengths that are not visible to the naked eye. These accomplishments underscore the adaptability of the probe and its capacity to yield significant data in several scientific domains. With the Parker Solar Probe's upcoming closest encounter with the Sun in 2024, we anticipate further revelations that will enhance our comprehension of the Sun and its impact on the solar system. The journey of the probe is not only a showcase of engineering, but also of how curious people are and how much we want to understand the world. Thank you for coming along on this interesting tour of the Parker Solar Probe's accomplishments. We can expect even more important discoveries that will help us learn more about the Sun and how it affects our lives as the project goes on. Stay tuned for more news about this amazing trip into the center of our solar system.